It is cup final time. As you can see, I'm in my suit. If we was just in Fair Play Cup final or any other final, I would not worn. I would not have bothered, right? But after Fair Play Cup final, we're going to go straight in and play for Champions League final. Hopefully we can win it. If we don't win it, is this season going to be a season of failure? I feel like it hasn't been. I think we've played really well, a bit inconsistent. Hence why we haven't won the league. And if we jump into the table, our season's finished in the Premier League and Man City won it. Liverpool came second and we've come third. It's the second season in a row we've come third. But there's a couple of things I want to point out and compare to last season. A, we've got 89 points. Liverpool and Man City got 96 and 97. Wow. Last season, if we look back at last season for Man City, what they got, and here it is. They got 89 points sacked the same as us goal difference 61 we go back to premier league we got a goal difference of 61 so we basically goal difference and points last season we got sacked same as man city and man city won for treble we could win a double fa cup and the champions league i mean look at man city they scored 101 goals and conceded 20 goal difference 81 harland man he's just a beast and looking at harland he scored 34 goals in 30 five games next player under that was Udogard. he got 20 goals and played 36 and then our young wonder kid Hoyland 21 years old he got 18 goals 22 games maybe I should have started him a little bit more unfortunately he lost form at the end of the season is that going to pay for price and we've got some injuries as well going into these cup finals if we look at what we did last season, that we came third, 75 points to our 89. Sorry, but that is a very good season in my eyes. 15 goal difference last season to our 61. We scored 91 goals and conceded 30. Any other season, we would have won it. But Liverpool and Man City, just another level. We took the level to get to where Man City was last season, but they've just gone again take another step i just can't believe it but hey yo we are in two cup finals and i am very excited this is our lineup so we're playing brentford in for final fair play to brentford they're my local team i am from west london and as a kid i've always followed brentford and i still do i still follow brentford but they're not my obviously number one team i support Sheffield wednesday brentford are doing better maybe i need to switch alliances nah i, I, I just can't do that not that type of fan so we're playing unana varan casemiro Martinez, Dalot, Van de Beek, Fernandez, Reglon, Sancho, Mount and Rashford. I'm playing Mount on the wing. It's very hard for me to get Van de Beek out and Fernandez are both on form but Mount's doing okay as well and plus we've got some injuries as well. Rashford's up top. Hoyland's off form and still coming back from a slight knock. Who else have we got out? Oh yeah, Marshall was picking up really good form and he got injured. Obviously we've got uh, other wonder kid missing and that's Ganacho who's had a really Really great season but again injured here we go so brentford's recent form drawn drawn lost lost so they haven't won one in five and i don't know how far back that goes our form hasn't been great either but lost one one lost drawn so lost two in five but they have been some hard games liverpool man city man city man city liverpool All right here we go we are at Wembley and for Champions League final is at Wembley as well who we are playing Bayern Munich one game at a time though let's try and get tra our first trophy with Man United now 15 minutes played and Brentford are holding all for possession at the moment I hate this kit clash uh, both red kits I know it's neutral but jeez Casemiro van der Beek Bruno Fernandes has a crack or it could be for start of something for Man United to get back to where they was. And Rashford gets through. Now, was that offside? Flags up. Flag up. Checking VAR. Goal just loud. Yeah, linesman had flag up. Still went to VAR. What do we make of that first half? Couple of bookings and a disallowed goal pretty much sums up. Brentford started off really well with their holding possession and then we've just grown into the game. All right, we've got the ball. Sancho, Delot, Casemiro, Van der Beek. What can he do? Oh, he's drilled good dribbling to Mount. Don't lose it, Mount. Oh no, it's dropped to Reglon. Come on, Reglon. Yes. Just about to make a change. I think I still will because Mount is playing rubbish. Injury time. Oh, Sancho's injured. Oh, another injury. Come on, Ericsson there, 
Thunderbeak there. Um, Tommy on. Boring game. But, oh, corner. One minute over. Just to seal it. 98th minute. All done. We have won for FA Cup. Yes. I'll take that. Happy with that. I mean, it's been a good season. I mean, we've already gone through the league. Equal to what Man City achieved last season in the league. Everyone said that was a good season for Man City. I know they won for treble. But we matched their points. We matched their goal difference. We won for FA Cup. If we win for Champions League. I actually like the like. Beautiful for FA Cup. Prestigious trophy. I'll take that. So, so far, I've done... This is my second save, and this is now my fourth trophy. Happy with that. Can I get my fifth in the next game? If we play like that against Bayern Munich, I don't think we're going to win. We need to step up. They had one shot, none on target. That's really disappointing from Brentford. They held a bit of possession. We got chances, right? Seven, four, got two goals, clear cut chances. Passes completed, 90, got the exact same. Tackles one, a little bit more. It was one, round same, not too bad. And high intensity sprints. Our players played a bit better. I think quality just won over then. Yes, yes, yes. Congratulations, what a win. All right, so the celebrations happen really quickly from our FA Cup win. We move on to the next final, Champions League. So our team looks like Anuna, Varane, Casemiro, Martinez, Van Bissaka, Van Der Beek, Hernandez, Reglon, Sancho, Rashford and Hoyland. So Hoyland comes back in, move Rashford back into his usual position and Mount drops to the bench. We played defensively well against Brentford. Can we now kick on against a bigger opposition? Now, I know Munich. I did a save with them. We won three trophies. Didn't do that well in the Champions League. So it's going to be really disappointing if Bayern Munich wins for Champions League against me. I'm probably going to cry. Here we go. We go out and line up. I think I kind of want to watch all of this animation. The big game. Suited and booted. Here we go, kickoff has gone by Munich versus Man United. Remembering 99. 1999, right? For heroics then. All right, we've got the ball. Van der Beek breaks forward, gets the ball to Sancho. Hate these click kick clashes. We had it against Brentford as well. Really annoying. Sancho runs it in Hoyland. Oh, would have been a fantastic start. All right, Munich's got the ball. Muller, Apocano, Kadira. My mouth cursor. Kane. Kane's really dropping back. That's what he does, right? Right, Nua. We're pressing. It's nervous when things like this happen. Did we get the press encounter or are they going to get a chance from this highlight? Could go either way, right? Right, loads of space out there. Sane. And he goes to Van Basso. Van Basaka, he can't get through, but we're passing it around a little bit now. Couldn't find space. Hoyland's found for space, actually. He's got the ball. And it drops to Fernandez. Nua's got the ball. Kimmich, we're pressuring. Press, pressuring? I was going to say pressuring. But it and pressing at the same time. So it's pressuring. It's just weird. The nerves. Come on. We have got a good press. And it's fallen to Hoyland. He finishes it. What a mistake by, by Munich. They gifted us that goal. And I've just realised, just like in the cut, I've got no highlights on. Maybe I'll just leave replays on. I do, when I'm playing games and I'm not recording live reaction, I'll just take it off because I'll show you the highlights. Right, right Bayern Munich's got the ball. No, they don't. He's giving it away to us. Casemiro. Sancho finds Van der Beek. Was it a right choice to bring him in? Oh, unlucky Sancho. But Van der Beek, he's just been Mr. Consistent for me. Nothing amazing, but consistent. Oh, just before halftime, we've got Marcus Rashford out injured. These bloody injuries. I don't think we'll be playing Ganacho. Maybe last 10 minutes if we really need to or in extra time or something like that. Uh, Rashford. Oh, Marshalls. Uh, is it too soon to play him? Uh, you know what? I'm going to put Sancho on for left and bring on Anthony. Anthony scored that fantastic goal in for 98 minutes since Brentford. The fans have been fantastic for us. Yeah, keep on applying that approach. So we got five shots. 
one on target. I think we had the majority of possession as well. All right, Anthony to Varane. Varane. I oh, Varane does this too much. Crap passing. And they've scored from that crap pass, Varane. So many times against bigger teams. Varane. Have, it's just my centre pair. I even had to take out, play it out of defence from my tactics. Because we can't. And they're still playing out of defence and not listening to my tactical instruction. That was poor. Easy goal. Again, one apiece in mistakes, right? Bayern Munich made a mistake and we've now made a mistake. How costly will that be? This is not good for us. Bruno Fernandes, he's off the Mason Mount. Mr. Captain, he's not impressing for me. Maybe he doesn't like Ben and Mazzella. Pretty like that role. Ireland's off for Martial. Varane. I think Varane's going to have to come off. And that's, yeah, that was just for that. And he's playing crap. Ah, uh, please don't let them score in for last minutes. Just can't take that. It's just the most annoying. Oh, I like it, Sancho. Hate games like that, but they score like 98, 96 minute, and you've just got no hope of changing and stuff. Three minutes. Any highlights? It's gone to fifth. All right, extra time. Yeah, look, they, that goal brought them right back into it. They was getting momentum. We brought back a bit of momentum. Sometimes XG does tell you for story. But I reckon if they had the XG and for momentum bar graph at the back of this, really show me a picture more than anything, I guess. Anthony wasn't a right choice. He's having a crap game. You know what? I'm going to swap them. Anthony played well on that left. And I'm going to bring in Scott McTominay because he's a workhorse. Right. But I mean, it's got a corner. Make it short. Kimmich to Guerrero. Bamba Saka wins it. Gets the ball up to Martial. Marshall get it. And it's kind of falling to Sancho now. Sancho with that attack running down for right. Passes it back to Nezio. McTominay. What can he do with it? He finds the ball out on for left to Anthony. Anthony's looking around. Finds Rogelon. He's had a fantastic season for Man United. Anthony's taking it around. Brilliant goal. Anthony, yeah, move him onto that left. That definitely pays off. I was thinking, what's he doing? But he found for space. Dribbled around him. Gets the goal. Is that for winner or is there more to play? Is Bayern Munich going to throw more stuff at us? All right, we've got the ball. Nezio, don't do anything stupid in defence. Tries to find Anthony. Samara finds it forward. I might have to take him off. He's got yellow card. We don't want any sending offs. Anthony, what can he do on this left again? He finds it into mount. Oh, unlucky. I'll make one more change. Casemiro. Don't trust him on that yellow. Let's bring in Amrabat. Plays it short to Minje. Muller. Casemiro wins it. He's on that yellow. He hasn't come off yet. Oh, playing it around defence. Nice to Casemiro. To Martial. To McTominay. Sancho. Sancho finds Mount. Drops to Anthony. Anthony tries to cross it in and nothing. Lema clears. Now to Komen. Komen finds space. No, he doesn't. Martinez cleans it up to Reglon. Reglon to Casemiro. It's a long highlight. Anthony. Anthony finds it into Mount. Mount runs it through. Can he lob it? Oh, crossbar. Unlucky. Oh, we've got another extra time. Half to go. Let's play. Never clears it long. Picks it long. Pulls to Sancho. Sancho, what can Sancho do? Remember Saka. Going against Sancho. Sancho. Get it into for box. McTominay has a crack. What a goal. It's 3 1. It looks like it's all over. We have done the double. We are for Champions League and FA Cup winners. And in for league, don't forget, I can't stress enough, we got the same as Man City did last season 89 points, 61 goal difference. It's just they was on another level this season, Man City and Liverpool. But we do. The Champions League and FA Cup. Oh, wow. I'm so pleased. It's been such an up and down season. But it's going to be all over. And it is. Yes. It was well worth wearing my suit. I'm so happy. I even wear for, wore for red tie for Man United. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, I'm so glad. Look at that. Beautiful. Champions League winners. Ah, oh, it just looks beautiful.
Let's quickly have a look at the stats. So by Munich, 12 shots, four on target. Us, 15 shots, five on target. So just nudging a little bit there. Clear cut chances, we had three to their one. Ended up 3-1. So just putting away clear cut chances there. We had a little bit of possession, a little bit more corners. We fouled a little bit more. Passes completed around the same. We won more tackles. Headers won. We was a little bit more there. Uh, intensity sprints we had more and our players played a little bit better on their ratings well done boys well done just yes, amazing you will remember this game when you retire i want to make sure that that's clear on that there it is just confirmation on my emails man united celebrate a double um by munich must hate man united man united now won it four times balls in happy anthony impresses yeah, hmm, might have to reconsider him. Probably will want to go, probably just raises his stock in valuation. We've been given 6.4 million for Champions League revenue, television revenue. We've been given another 24.6 million in coefficient ranking. Uh, we pay a bonus to 22.5 million. Yeah, happy with that. Bonus is paid out. Oh, how much have we paid out to everyone? Ah, uh, to me, I get 325k. Woohoo, what should I buy? New car, Monaco, 6.6 .6 million for Anthony Martial. 2 million to Sporting, 1.5 million to Real Madrid, 1.1 million to Ajax, but then Vanny Dembeek, happy with that. Anthony, again, he's come good in the last two games for us as well. Happy with that. Well, there we have it. We did for double FA Cup and Champions League winners. We brought back glory days to Man United. If you're a Man United fan, I hope I did you proud. And even just for English football, right? Champions League. I love seeing English teams win for Champions League. With the exception of Arsenal. Sorry, Arsenal fans. You beat us in two cup finals that year, remember? That's why I don't like you. Not you personally, the club. My next series is going to be for Unknown to Icon, where we take a non-league team and we want to be kind of icon. It's not making them great because end of the day, we want to stay with the club as long as possible, progress them through the leagues and who knows? If you like this video, come on, we did the double with Man United. Please give it a like so it goes out to a well. And if you want to carry on watching content like this, don't forget we've got the Unknown to Icon series coming. And then we've got our How To series as well for the pre-game editor. I'm still working on loads of stuff in the background. So you know what you need to do if you want to catch that content. Hit that subscribe button and I'll catch you on the next one.